<laughs> we are painting a fence today with the outfit and hopefully it will just make the garden look a bit nicer and a bit brighter for the patients who are coming up. <laughs> yeah, I was really happy to come to the hospice because they care for my gran and so it's nice to be able to do something for them to say thank you for what they did for us. I think it's good for Barcock to put something back into the community when we've been here for a hundred years. Um, and some of these projects we don't even know sit right on a doorstep. Um, like the Thistle project here which supports people who um, live a normal life. This is the first one that I've done. Uh, the first one I've had a chance to be part of. Um, it's been it's been really good to I suppose give something back to meet colleagues that I wouldn't normally get the chance to work with. Well, last time we were here, we came together inside, and there was at least five people there whose kids mm -hmm. were actually using it that weekend. Yeah, so, yeah, so you can see there's a definite connection. Right. Gene, <laughs> are you going to put that specially prepared by the CEO? <laughs> <laughs> We're here at Cunningham House to help um, do the gardens for the elderly, the patients here have got dementia. So we've come to make their garden look nice so that in the summer they've got somewhere to sit out and enjoy the sun. Here locally in Grangemouth, um, Decent Bad Cock is a big organisation employing a lot of local people and been able to, to give back to the, the community as important. Today we are refurbishing an animal shelter and they're trying to bring this place back to how it was a few years ago because it was recently closed for a couple of years so it's got a bit of As you can see at the moment we've just taken the sides out and we're about to put some new sides in and eventually put a new roof on. Uh, good team, all working hard and uh, we're getting on with it. We're down here at High Flyers in Mumbai which is a learning centre for people with uh, learning difficulties. Um, we're trying to here today to sort out their garden and improve on it, see if we can make it a better environment for them. Oh, oh. Oh. The guys did a sterling job cleaning away the stones, relaying the membrane, so hopefully the garden once completed will be a lot lower maintenance and easier for the people who visit to, to use through the summer. I think we'll probably come back here again because it's something where we, there is a bit of sustainability. It will give us an opportunity to really build a good uh, relationship in the local area, which is not too far from Tipton. What we're doing today is we're giving the opportunity to, for some people to come in from the job centre uh, and have some career taster type opportunities in things like welding, uh, pipe fitting, mechanical fitting. Now what we're looking to do in the future is work with the job centre to give individuals short, sharp courses which will allow them to have transferable skills. I mean, this is really important from our perspective to make sure that people uh, are not forgotten about who aren't at work at the moment. We're just uh, doing a bit of uh, maintenance to uh, Murray Hall just to make it more inviting and more uh, exciting for the kids like we've painted the fences. We've uh, cleaned all this area here and out the front we're painting all the railings and makes it more inviting for the families and the kids. This puts uh, a lot back into the local community which is good, good to see as these are places where we uh, pass on a regular basis so it's good to see us contributing from, from it. I have a prospect house which uh, looks after disadvantaged children and uh, provides respite care. Well, this morning I've been working on the, uh, the hole for the trampoline. We've uh, put the thing together. We've just received delivery of all the timber for our log cabin, uh, and we've been spraying down the wall. I think it's a great uh, effort by the team, and obviously the weather was bad at the beginning. But obviously the spread was too high. We never give up. I think we really enjoyed the day. So I think it's a great uh, initiative by the company worldwide. I really enjoy being part of the Tucson team. There we go. Yay! It means a lot to us that the guys are coming here to help us. Um, the brownies will be able to play out in the front and out in the back, which we've not been able to do, so it's going to be a safe environment for them to play in. This village hall is very important to the village. 
but we've never been able to make the full use of the paddock behind it before. And with this storage unit, and with the electricity cables that you've laid, we'll be able to use it for fundraising and social events to a far greater extent. So we're very grateful to Doosans indeed for this donation and the effort they put into it. Well, this enables Doosan to uh, be part of the community. It pro gives Doosan a good profile in the community as well. But the main thing is, we're helping people who need a little bit of help.